The State Gaming Commission is meeting in Springfield today. 22 News reporter Taylor Knight's now live in the studio. Tell us how MGM could be impacted when another casino opens in the eastern part of the state next month. Yeah, that casino is the Encore Boston Harbor. It's a $2.6 billion casino built by Wynn, scheduled to open on June 23rd. At a Massachusetts Gaming Commission meeting today in Springfield, MGM Springfield President Mike Mathis gave a quarterly report that included revenue for the casino. March was the best month MGM Springfield had since its opening, but how could the new casino in Everett impact business here in western Massachusetts? Mathis told 22 News most of MGM's customers come from the I-91 corridor, but the new casino will definitely be a competitor in the market. We're always looking to increase um, our reach, and, and we'll see what they're doing, and, and looking forward to the challenge of, of facing a really high-quality competitor in the market. The commission's meeting in Springfield today comes just two days after MGM Resorts International ended talks to buy the new Wynn Casino. If that deal had gone through, MGM Springfield would have been forced to close. Later on 22 News, starting at 5 o'clock, hear the economic impact MGM Springfield has had on the greater downtown area. Taylor Knight, 22 News.